Okay, welcome back, algebra students. Okay, now we're going to go take this one step further and we're going to go into creating our own equations using these graphs. Now, since we're creating the equations, we can choose any manner we want. I can make up the variable. It doesn't tell me what's a variable. Well, I'm going to make my variable x. Now, I'm not going to make it the hard way and read it backwards because I'm in control here. I'm deciding what's going to be. I'm not going to be a smart guy and try and show you you can write it this way. I'm going to write it this way because it's easier and I don't want people getting tricked by my stuff here. So I look at this. So what's my number? First step, the number. Well, there's only one number that's any value here. It's negative 3. So I put it here. Now I ask myself the next thing. Is it greater than or equal to? And if you remember from the last lesson, I made the little list up here, and I said greater than goes to this direction. Well, it's not going in that direction. It's clearly going in this direction, the less, so it's less than. So this number x is less than. Now, the next question is, is it equal to or not? Well, you can see here that you can see through this circle, which means it's not equal to, so I don't put a bar underneath here. If I did, I would draw a little bar underneath here, but if it was filled in, but it's not. And I don't know how else I can make this lesson any more interesting, but we could change it up. If I saw something like this, let's, let's make something completely the opposite. See? Make this nice and easy. I put the put five slashes. I'm going to do this. I just want to do it in red, because I feel red is the color they use. I will use red. And I'll fill in this box, and I'll make it go this way. So it's a little bit the opposite of what I did. So what do I do next? I'm going to write my equation here. So as I said, I can make it whatever I want. I'm going to go to the right, because I think that's easier. And my number here, in this case, is 2. Now, x is going to the right, so I know it's greater than. And the dot is filled in, so it's equal to. End of story. That's it, guys. I don't know if I can make that any easier. Good luck. All right, I will mm -hmm. talk to you soon. Have a great day.